Good morning from Thailand, everyone. It was time to leave Vietnam and embark on a new adventure, try to discover what beers Thailand has to offer apart from the two I had already sampled. And for this adventure, I decided to get me a little bike. It's an old little bike. It's a Honda Click, beat up and bruised, but will be just fine for this adventure. So, I decided to name him Heine. And today, me and Heine are going to embark on a little mission to find some Thailand beer and give it a try. So, I hope you join me on this journey. See ya. Off we go. So after a long walk and a ride, we found ourselves a little beer brewed by Singer Road Boon Brewery and that we're going to give a try in a while. It's been an eventful day. I went to various places, quite nice on a bike, and there are plenty of beers for us to sample yet. But today we're going to try my beer by Singa Brewery and see what it's like. late afternoon been riding around town and deciding what to taste today so we'll go with the my beer see if it's better than Vietnamese beer see if it's better than Chang or Leo which we had already tried from across the river on the Lao side Let's see what Thailand has in store for us. Took a while before we finally got to it, but here we are with my beer brewed by the famous Singa Brewery, which also brews the oldest beer in Thailand called Singa. And this is a Singa product you can see it's called my beer and I'm quite anxious to give it a go see if it's better than Chang and see if it's better than Leo okay so let's pop it open first impressions mm, smells a bit fruity and malty so here we have a cup let's give it a go Pours a nice light golden color. Mm. 
the smell is quite interesting. A little bit grassy, fruity and malty. Let's see what it tastes like. The head is nice, an inch, still going. Oh, it's not the worst. It's fairly decent. The hops are faint, but the malt is rich. The body is semi-thin, semi-full. Carbonation is fairly strong. But it does have something nice about it. I think it's 5% alcohol. So it's a light lager style beer, but it's fairly likable. The malts are there, hops are faint, but the texture is fairly full. I think to me it seems quite a lot, well, more better accomplished than Leo or Chan. A little bit of bitter aftertaste. A nice surprise by Singa. Take one more, take a look once more. My beer by Singa. Not bad at all. I'll give it a six. I'm, I'm actually nicely surprised with it. So next time if you see this beer in the shop, I definitely recommend it. It may not be the best of beers, but it's decent. And I'm actually nicely surprised. I'll give it six, six and a half almost. So cheers to everyone. Thanks for watching. Mm. Give it a try if you come across it. All right, see you later, bye.